travel 1,300 light years to the Serpens Nebula, where the James Webb Space Telescope has captured an extraordinary display, perfectly aligned protostellar outflows. These cosmic jets, streaming from emerging stars, not only enhance the beauty of this stellar nursery, but also challenge our understanding of how stars are born, presenting a synchronized celestial phenomenon that captivates and mystifies astronomers. In this video, we will delve into how these cosmic events were captured, explore the pivotal insights they offer, and discuss the broader impact of these discoveries on our understanding of the universe. Settled in the vastness of space, the Serpens Nebula serves as a cosmic nursery for new stars. Webb's latest images have revealed a series of protostellar outflows jets of gas ejected from nascent stars. What makes these jets special is their alignment, all pointing in the same direction, suggesting a synchronized dance choreographed by the laws of physics and clearing away excess angular momentum from the collapsing star-forming material, allowing the nascent stars to stabilize and grow. The remarkable alignment observed in the Serpens Nebula suggests a magnetic field that orchestrates the directional flow of these jets. This could mean that magnetic fields play a more significant role in star formation than previously thought. The observations were made possible by Webb's advanced instruments, particularly the near-infrared camera and the mid-infrared instrument, which allow astronomers to peer through the dust that traditionally obscured these early stages of star formation. This capability not only provides clearer images, but also helps in analyzing the chemical compositions and physical conditions of these celestial nurseries. By studying the Serpens Nebula, scientists hope to apply these learnings to other star-forming regions in the universe. Each observation adds a piece to the puzzle of our cosmic origins, helping to explain not just how stars form, but also how complex life might arise from these stellar beginnings. These protostellar jets are not just spectacular to behold, they are also key to understanding the forces at play in star formation. The alignment supports theories that as clouds collapse to form stars, resulting stars inherit a momentum that dictates this uniform orientation. Furthermore, where these jets collide with surrounding material, they illuminate the processes that likely lead to the formation of planets and other celestial bodies. At the heart of the Serpens Nebula, the high-speed collisions between jets of gas and the nebula's denser material are spectacular. These collisions create shock waves that propagate through the nebula, compressing material and potentially triggering the formation of new stars. This cascade effect, where star formation begets more star formation, is a dynamic process that Webb can observe in real time. The data from Webb suggests that the conditions leading to aligned outflows might be more common than previously believed, proposing a standardized model of star formation across different environments. The collisions also distribute elements such as carbon, oxygen, and silicon throughout the nebula. By analyzing the light spectra emitted from these elements, Webb can determine the chemical composition of the region, providing insights into the raw materials available for future planetary systems. The observations in the Serpens Nebula and similar regions are being compared to various established theoretical models of star formation and galaxy development. One significant theory being challenged by these findings is the standard model of cosmology, particularly regarding the early formation and size of galaxies. Webb has discovered galaxies that appear far more massive and mature than what was thought possible at such an early stage after the Big Bang suggesting a need to revise our understanding of galaxy formation. For instance, traditional theories propose that galaxies slowly grew from small clouds of stars and dust, but Webb has found evidence of massive galaxies existing much earlier than previously thought, challenging this slow growth model. Adding to the intrigue, Webb has spotted similar phenomena in different regions of space suggesting that these processes could be universal. This discovery not only propels further studies, but also deepens our inquiry into whether we're seeing a cosmic pattern or mere coincidence. This phenomenon is an observation of aligned protostellar outflows in various nebula, which hints at a common thread in the tapestry of star formation. 
This pattern, observed across different stellar environments, suggests a more standardized set of physical laws governing the birth of stars than previously known. These findings provide critical data points for astrophysicists modeling star formation processes. Moreover, these findings can have broader implications for our understanding of planetary system formation. By studying the speed, direction, and composition of these outflows, scientists can infer the distribution of materials that are critical in the formation of planets. This data is invaluable for constructing more accurate models of how our own solar system formed, providing insights into the likely conditions that lead to the formation of Earth-like planets in other star systems. In conclusion, the implications of these discoveries are vast. Astronomers plan to use Webb to continue monitoring these regions, looking for changes over time and further aligning the observational data with theoretical models. Every discovery about star formation processes not only helps us understand our own sun's origins, but also informs our search for other Earth-like planets. Knowing how stars and their accompanying planetary systems form from common interstellar materials helps scientists predict where and how to look for potentially habitable planets. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon to keep up with the mysteries of the universe unraveling right before our eyes.